it's impossible, I know, to predict what might happen over the rest of 2024. But what's, what's your gut feeling? What do you think are the most likely scenarios, Dave? You're a very shrewd observer. You've done a lot of deep thinking. You're plainly uh, concerned about it. <laughs> I'm definitely concerned about it. Um, look, on the political side, if you just listen to the polls right now, Trump is in the lead and, and, and it seems like minorities are breaking and we're seeing a whole bunch of things happen with the Democrats. And I think largely because of the protests we've seen since October 7th, I think Jews are leaving the Democrats in droves, blacks are leaving the Democrats in droves, gay people have seen the end of identity politics. So there's all sorts of reasons to believe that Trump can win an election, for sure. At the same time, there's just so many X factors right now. Trump's health, uh, sorry, uh, Biden's health is an X factor. Trump's health actually could be an X factor. He's, he's no spring chicken. Um, who knows what happens as I, I laid out a very dark future a moment ago as it relates to immigration and some of the things that could happen in our borders. That could be a problem. You know, there, we never got, and your country neither, uh, ever got any sort of, uh, we never tied COVID into a nice little wrapped package and said, okay, we're not gonna do this again. So, so some version of COVID or disease X could come back. You know, we can go through the litany of things that could happen along the way. Um, I would say the best thing, if, if Trump and Biden are the two candidates that we will be sitting with uh, that first week of November, the best thing that could happen for America would be that Trump would win in a landslide. And, and through winning in a landslide, and then, as he has said when he's at his best, the best revenge will be success. And if he can get America back on track and get people to be proud of the country again and get the world to see that America is ready to lead again, then maybe it can revert some of this stuff. Now, of course, the problem with that is that we know what the left will do if Trump is president again. They will be in the streets again. They will be burning the cities again. They will be telling us that fascism has arrived and what wouldn't you do to stop fascism? So, so it is not a perfect situation, but if Biden wins, well, we know. The slow descent to hell that we're on right now will, will continue and it will probably accelerate. Um, if Trump wins by a landslide, I think there's a chance of a reversion. But again, and John, I'd be happy to sit down with you on my show. Why don't we do a show maybe in, in October or so and, and see where we're at with things? Because I think it's possible that one, if not both of them are not on the ballot. There's just nothing here that is set in stone at this point. So we shall see.